today we are driving my 2019 WRX full bolt-ons other than headers. It's been a long journey with this car since the last time you guys have even seen it unless you guys follow my Instagram, but even that's been lacking pretty good. But if you are on my channel right now, you probably already know that what I've been posting this past year has mostly been cinematic edits and stuff about my photography. So since the last update we did, the last vlog, if you want to call it that, the last vlog I believe I was introducing this car. So I always said, oh, there's going to be lots of new content. It's going to be fantastic. This car is going to bring so much activity to the channel. Well, I kind of, I, I was wrong. So shortly after that video, I got hired at a um, local dealership as a detailer. And I stayed there for about a year and a half. And then last, last year in May, I got laid off because of the pandemic. And um, that's kind of when I really picked up my camera again and decided that, hey, like photography and video is something that I really am, is, is something that I really want to do. <clears throat> so I decided that from there on out, I would really focus on um, building on my skills and practicing photography and video. So that's kind of where we are now. I mean, since that, that was about a year ago when I started. And uh, since then, I've gone through... <laughs> A horrible partnership which that'll probably be a video down the line of, of explaining that um, two two actual jobs and then um, what else so the partnership two actual jobs and um, right now I've, I've graduated college and I'm trying to figure out the best path for my careers so I've gotten a few offers from places um, so I'm trying to really figure out my best options but my whole business at heart is definitely something I want to keep up with. I want to start putting more content onto YouTube because I know I haven't been doing such a good job at that. So yeah, I mean, I wanted to post this one as kind of like a little update, like letting you guys know that I still I still care about my YouTube. Um, obviously, you guys still see the, the car cinematics being, being posted up, but um, I want to get more personal on my YouTube than anything. I want to... I want to start doing these vlogs i'm gonna start doing these drives i want to kind of dive into my car a little bit more and give you guys an update because this is this car has been through a lot since that first video of introducing it onto the channel that was about two years almost three years ago so a lot has changed and i think that we need to sit down and make a video explaining the changes and explaining what happened so also uh this upcoming week I have a lot of stuff planned for this car I have about four or five boxes of, of modifications to be put onto this car so um, this car I mean if you haven't seen it in a while go check it out at um, my Instagram at WR action W R X S H U N you'll be able to see in the most recent um, content of it because I don't really post it a lot but we got we got some cool we got some really awesome stuff coming up so i'm really stoked on that um but i'll probably be doing some more vlog styles um here soon in order to give you guys some more content and a little look into my life i have plenty of photography content if you guys are interested in some more of that i mean i don't think i've even posted anything on my channel about that either so if you guys haven't seen my, my uh, photography account or my media account, go down to, um, I might try to link everything in the bio, but it's at Noha Media, N-O-H-A underscore M-E-D-I-A. That's my business account where I do all my photography, all my videos. That stays updated more than my specific car Instagram. Everybody here in Morgantown wants me to uh, start uploading on my channel a little bit more a little less of the cinematic stuff which everybody loves they just like well we need to get some more personal uh content in because people want to see your car people want to see what you're doing with your car as of right now i have one of the most unique exhaust systems on this car that you can buy which it's the sbtk uh muffler or sbtk side exit for the 2015 WRX. Literally comes right out of the bumper. There's nothing under me, there's nothing in the rear. It's right out of the bumper. So I will be making some videos with that too. But yeah, I mean, we're gonna we're gonna 
we're going to be doing some stuff guys and i want you guys to hold me accountable as well um if, if i've been lacking on content and you guys aren't liking the content that i'm posting say something just just go ahead and be like noah get your shit together because i know a lot of my subscriber base is from when i had my ford escape but unfortunately that's not going to be the content anymore I've grown as a person, that car is long gone. It's probably driving around somewhere in Virginia right now. I keep on getting Carfax updates for it every so often. So I believe it's still on the road, but it's just not, I mean, it's not with me anymore, so I have no clue. Um, I try to stay active in those Ford Escape pages as much as I can, but uh, it, I mean, it's just not really me anymore. I got this car, I got a business that I run personally, I got, full-time job that I'm trying to figure out I got a, <laughs> a girlfriend who I love and, and I got to spend some time with her so yeah the Ford Escape stuff kind of got kicked back to the curb I I love everything about him still and I mean I check up on the pages every so often but I, I just don't really pay attention a lot but this is basically going to be the content going forward. It's going to be vlogs, installs, and cinematic content. Um, probably some photography walks. I might do a few trials of that, trying to get exactly how I want to format them all. I, this is also filmed on a brand new GoPro. Um, so I got that kind of because my one camera, I'm shooting with a Sony a7 III now for all of my cinematic content. And I want to do some behind the scenes video for that. But if you only got one camera, you can't really do any behind the scenes content. So I picked up this GoPro as kind of a second shooter probably will be using this one for vlogs more than anything the sony will stick for cinematics and uh, photography walks and all that that stuff but uh gopro is probably going to be where it's at for now if you guys don't like the gopro or if you prefer the sony just let me know and we can figure something out but yeah so i wanted to give you guys a little bit of an update on on my life and what's been going on um so yeah let's uh Let's cut her here.